allegations flew at a recent Boyle Heights neighborhood council meeting. Council President Jonathan Echavarria claimed a fellow council member behaved unprofessionally after she effectively accused him of being a bully and a colleague of corruption. Echavarria expressed his frustration towards Vida Gashkai, head of outreach for the council. He says she shouldn't have accused the planning and land use chair for being a bully and running the council as a quote dictatorship. So this doesn't give me any joy to do this, but I think we need to discuss um, something that's been taking place, um, and it is the um, conduct of the outreach chair. And the first thing is that uh, the outreach chair accused the planning and land use chair of being on the payroll of the Sears building owner during the planning and land use chair's meeting. Slanderous claim that he's being paid by the Sears building owner. Critics say that Echeverria had some potentially slanderous claims of his own. So this is a pattern. Um, again, I have the dates here. I have this email that was sent out to everybody on the beach and see as well as community members and government agencies um, with unprofessional and false accusations via email. This one was directed towards Brenda Martinez. My opinion is you should resign as chair as you haven't had a tech meeting in four months and you are childish as a fair. Um, it says we're trying to change and you get on our BHNC meetings and saying I'm harassing you crazy. The president denied all allegations that were made against him and other board members by Ms. Gashkai. He filed a petition to remove Gashkai as head of outreach and remove her as a board member of the council. Gashkai says she made numerous attempts trying to talk to the president, urging him not to control what was her job as head of outreach and her responsibility to post important information on their social media platforms. Okay, I have something I'd like to respond. I have it written up. Furthermore, it's unfortunate that you have abused your power as president and unilaterally created the agendas and made decisions that have compromised the BHNC and its ability to conduct their duties. I have repeatedly requested both orally and in writing that the BHNC uphold the bylaws and comply with our obligations of holding all our meetings. Community members reached out to me and requested that all information and events regarding the Sears development project be shared with the community. All community events should be posted regardless if they happen to coincide with the BHNC meetings. Gashkai agreed to step down as head of outreach because it was a lot to do while being a mother and she will remain on the council. Three, two, moving down, stepping down. So if people still want to talk about it, we can, but actually it's too much for me anyway to do, to have the outreach chair position even though I, I love it. And, but right now at this time in my life with the baby and everything else, because we still do have other work. For UT Community News, this is Brenda Munguia reporting from Boyle Heights.